Welcome to Mancha Radio Program. My name is Pra Siwant, and today you are with me again. And today is a, such a special day we, as we have the wonderful guest speaker. His name is Pra Sumbun. He also one of our um, teamwork, and he has a lot of experience as well about um, meditation. Right now, he is a um, meditation master at Mang Chat at Watson Dog, MTU my campus. And every day, a thousand of um, visitors come to Mang Chat. Um, as today, that there are a lot of gums as well that come to our Mang Chat. And I'm very glad to have you here. Okay, thank you very much. And... Uh Hi, Prashi Wan, and uh, hi, everyone, everyone who are listening to uh, Monk Chat Podcast today. And I'm very happy to be uh, with you today. And uh, today, uh, uh, we both, uh, Prashi Wan and me, are going to uh, talk something very interesting. Yes. Uh, so, uh, yes, yeah, so let, let's see what we're going to talk about today. I th- uh? um, today, we have very interesting um, topic. So the topic is about um, how to deal with the anger. How? Because many people have this problem in our society. As a few days ago, I heard the news. Um, there was the couple, and actually they already divorced, but his his ex-boyfriend still love her and do you know that um something was happened he used the gun to shoot ah, his I see. ex 
girlfriend. Yeah, that's terrible. Okay, I I, I heard about that new and actually that uh, that that case. So we brought up that uh, uh, what what you just mentioned about the new and actually, and that's what uh, that is related to what we're going to talk about today is about anger. No oh. uh, anger, uh, because it's very yeah. uh, big problem that uh, yes. uh, raising up in our society, especially in um, people life yes. nowadays. So, so we we it came to interesting because uh, there's many uh, cases that mm. uh, happen in the news that we we catch up the news and we saw that oh, there's many killing and happen. In especially in Thailand, so recently there's many many uh, cases about concern with the uh, shooting. Uh-huh. Yes, um, another case is about um, shooting in in Isan as well. Um, it is on 9th February 2020. It's not far ago. Um, there was the soldier killed 21 people in the shopping mall. Oh, I I heard about that new also, and actually in uh, uh, Latashima province and yes. in, in 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 the mall, and uh, a children actually uh, a furious a furious a children he, he kills lots of lots of people, and there's many uh, problem and losing of uh, for those who. Who, who who were killed mm. and and yeah so that that this came to interesting uh, uh, that we have to brought up and mention yes. and what uh, is behind of all of this situation. I I think after um, this new is released, people are scared of going out and going to the shopping mall as well, cause um it's very easy. Uh, for nowadays, that um, to buy a gun, so I, I think this is one of the main cause that um, for uh, something that's happened in our society. How do you mean that? So now today, people can easily get the gun, buy, get a gun, yeah. and ah, so that's why there's the criminal raising up, and it it will have something be- besides um, or inside that person that why one. Uh, he want to do. Why does he want to do it? Uh huh. It's just supposed to have something inside him or her. So what do you think about it? Yeah, I think it could be uh, many different reasons. That's why somebody can can do just a thing, killing mm-hmm. other people, and even sometimes even kill themselves. So I think uh, it's not only. Uh, one factor or one cause that will, will will make somebody to 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 do something harmful or threaten other people. I think uh, the 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 environment he or she live, the the people he so associate with, society. and and the way that he was raised in in the society or oh. in the community. I think all of this uh, affect some some someone behavior or even. Uh, the way that he think, uh, I think all of this thing. I, I, uh, what, uh, from my consideration, I think all of this thing all involve, and the society itself also have a very important role to shape somebody yes. to behave just a thing or harmful thing to the society. I think it's not from only individual one. I think uh, the society as a whole also have to be responsible for this kid as well. So, so you mean that um, the first one it must come from the parents, yeah. society, and could environment. Be. Yeah. So it connected with one another. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Um. And if now um, suppose that we know the cause of it and. How can we deal with it? Yeah, that that's why we 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 we, we come to. Um, I, I think it's very challenging for us to talk yes, about of course. this so topic. So that that's why we we have to come um, up with this topic, and and it's very interesting to talk about uh, like anger. Yeah. So I think of the main cause of the, of this uh, unhappy life. Yes, that's happened. I think uh, uh, anger. It's oh. something 
that does not happen automatically, but there is something、um, causes to happen. And today, to to be able to handle the anger, I think we 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 have to talk and we have to understand、yes. that how how the anger arising in somebody,、mm. and when and how to how to deal and react、mm. or approach anger is not just something they fear for, but it's something that we have to accept and let it go. So that's why I think、uh, we we we. I think we we have a better way to express our、uh, emotion or feeling, but most of the time, what people do, like、uh, in many many cases, and 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 the criminal or whatever, I think that that they just want to express the emotion or feeling that they have inside,、oh. and by maybe having other people and understanding that maybe if if they do so, they will be able to express such a feeling that's inside. From my point of view, I think that is the the wrong way to to react to the anger. Yeah. Because、um, so when we react to somebody or we tell something、um, from the suffering side to to them, I think they also feel suffer too, because at that moment we don't feel happy, and、mm-hmm. I think this is not the right way to to do it, and. I think that in in Buddhism, the Buddha has also mentioned how to deal with the anger as well. Ah,、uh, yeah. Actually, there's many, many, ah,、uh, uh, many, many words or many, many topic that、oh. the Buddha mentioned about ah、uh, anger.、Oh. And there's many people came to the Buddha and got angry at even the Buddha. You know. Oh yes, that I as. As I heard that there was the story about the anger,、um, many many story. <laughs> yes, of course, many story. And so yeah, and even the Buddha himself, he was angered by the people.、Absolutely. So you can meet in that. Yeah, in anger, in、uh, anger is one of them, the core problem, really core problem in our society. Hmm. Hmm. Uh. In 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 the Buddha time, and actually, there's there's a case that、uh, a pramana, a pramana is、uh, a a Hindu, Hindu 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 priest. Actually, he 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 got he got angry, he got angry because his、uh, his son、hmm. uh, practiced Buddhism,、oh. and he saw his son was、uh, meditating and closer and. He didn't do anything, and for his routine or for、uh, how work or something. So he got furious because,、oh. uh, because of he he thought it because of Buddhism, because of the Buddha, uh, uh, so make made his son to be like this. Oh, I, I think his father didn't understand the truth. Actually, his son is is working, but he is working with the mind, with the insight. How to be aware and how to control his feeling or emotion? Yes. So,、uh, mid understanding. Yes. That way, so he got furious and、oh. he came to the Buddha. Okay. And blame,、oh. you know, and say something, and blame. Oh, you are rude or whatever. I think a swear word to the Buddha. Oh. And you know what? 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 What surprise that the Buddha didn't even react in return or got angry. Oh. In return, but he just, he sm- just smile and silent, smile and listen, smile、oh. and listen with compassion. Also,、oh, we, the first thing we should do is listen, and with compassion it means ah、uh, listen deeply, in order to see the the core of of his problem. Yeah, absolutely. So he when he when he ah、uh, saw when he saw the Buddha. Uh, did so, so、uh, again he got even more <laughs> angry, you know. So he got even more angry, and he started to、uh, even like find find of the 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 bad word. Why is that?、Uh, to I'm I'm not sure. Maybe he got furious or he got frustrated because he,、uh, the Buddha didn't react anything and just smile, you know, smile, and then he just.、Uh, 
didn't know what to do, and even 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 the disciple of the Buddha all also got angry because oh why this this oh. this pramana came and like blame to to the Buddha. Oh. But the, the Buddha just maintained quietly and smile. But the, the other monks, uh, the Buddha follower, got very angry, like want to maybe uh, want to uh, revenge, want oh. to say something bad. That, but the Buddha, uh, he 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 stopped. Don't do so. And and then the Pramana, uh, when he already expressed his feeling. And he got back. He he like uh, went back to his house, mm-hmm. and uh, at night, and actually, he just like uh, he just like think about think about his word again and again, you know, again and again. And he 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 uh, the the picture of the smile of the Buddha oh. exists in his mind, and keep repeating, and and still it's make him couldn't couldn't. Couldn't sleep all night. Mm, it's because of he he worry um, his action or um, or because of the compassion of the Buddha. Uh, I'm not sure. Maybe because he feel guilty, or maybe he feel very sad, or maybe oh. he feel uh, he didn't feel good about what he just did to the Buddha, and like he feel maybe a shame of his own action. Uh, and he feel uh, very unhappy. Do you think that he will be able to understand why the Buddha didn't react anything? I think that is another way of the Buddha, the way another way to teach, teach another uh, way to teach. Uh, uh, the Buddha uh, teach people. So there's many different ways to teach the people. Sometimes you don't have to say anything oh. in return, you know. Sometimes I, I, I used to face this with somebody. Yeah, so uh, I think that that is another way of teaching because different people have different way to associate. Oh. Some people, they don't listen at all, but we just like just maintain and keep quiet and listen. I think that is the right way to teach someone. Actually, especially uh, the pramana, I think his word, he tried to uh, spread his word, or maybe threw the the fire to to the others. You yeah. Know? But the Buddha is like he didn't accept it. Accept the, that kind of feeling or anger at all. And so it's like yeah. it's just like it's like coming back to him. Yes, and of course. You see, he couldn't sleep because he just like repeat uh, repeatedly think about his word that what he said to the Buddha, and he feel. Very sad and very unhappy that he couldn't sleep. Um, the Buddha didn't react. I think this is one of his technique um, because he know that um, at that moment, if we react anything, it doesn't work because the one that who is um, having problem um, just tried. Um, to make him understand that um, whatever he said, it doesn't good enough. Uh, yeah. So yeah, maybe and and interestingly, and uh, at the pramana, he realized that what he he did is not the right thing. So he he felt guilty. Um. Then he went back to the Buddha and asked for a for apologize apologize uh, for the Buddha and uh, what I have done. Uh, uh, I, I apologize for my action. Then he, he finally accepted the Buddha and followed the teaching. Mm. And uh, the Buddha uh, told the monk, uh, made the in conclusion about uh, uh, this case is that uh, uh, when when we got when we uh, when we are angry and we try at the fire, it's like fire burning inside, inside our the mind. Body inside our mind so so most of the time we we often time uh throw the fire to other people always and at the same time we also burning ourselves uh-huh. Be- because the one who is trying to burn others he is suffer himself yes but he, he just didn't know them the right way to to deal with it right uh-huh, uh-huh. and 
do you, do you have on another crisis or another example that how can we help uh, handle with the anger? Uh, how how to deal? And actually, there's many different way. And I think uh, it is it 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 is important to 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 understand that how how to how uh, dangerous the anger yeah is. yeah we we have to see that what what is the oh. cause of the suffering or what is the cause of the uh, anger I, first. I think mindfulness also. One of the important thing that we should have yeah. it, with our mindfulness, we cannot yes. be aware of our emotion at that time. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Mindfulness can can deal all with all emotion actually, not only anger. With the other depression, uh, uh, depression, sadness, or whatever negative emotion, negative even negative thoughts. Mindfulness can can deal with all of this emotion. So. Also, yeah, of course, with anger, it's important. So, uh, yeah, so so this kid and actually, uh, what we're going to uh, find out is that uh, what 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 is the cause oh. of the sub or uh, what is the cause of the anger? And here, and 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 the, the Buddha or uh, Sali Buddha. Do, do you know Sali Buddha? Sali Buddha. He is one of the um, Buddha disciple, right? Yeah, one of the um, important one in Buddhism. Mm -hmm. I, I know him. Yes. Yeah. So he he said that uh, he explained that anger is a uh, uh, mean conflict. Conflict. Uh, it means conflict, hatred, uh, revenge. Oh, anger is kind of the negative thing. Yes, of course. And fierce violence because of bad word. And this is from the, the, the definition from Sali Buddha of the disciple of the Buddha. I, th I think the meaning is clear himself itself. Yes, yes. Um, so simply ang anger. So all the causes that is happening in our society, one of the main causes is because of the anger. Mm -hmm. And then it just spread in on all the wars. Yeah, so, uh, like, uh, much of the time, like, some people, uh, ask, uh, like, when, when we feel unsatisfied of something, especially, uh, like, uh, in, 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 uh, when I was younger, and actually, okay. uh, uh, I, 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 I was easily angry. Oh. Like, when I, like, want to get something or ask for something that, my mother could, couldn't give me couldn't something. Couldn't afford you. Yeah, so... And what did you do then? I, I cried. You cried. <laughs> I think this is one of the um, child is expressing his or her feeling. Yeah, that this the, the anger that uh, exists in us and actually uh, it's pretty clear that uh, most of the time when, when we feel unsatisfied and actually at the moment that uh, I, I was crying and actually I, I felt I, I get... Uh, I got angry. Angry caused us to cry. So if we observe carefully and actually when we cry, we feel something inside. Con inside it's like uh, mm. stress and conflict. Um, what is that? Yeah, it's because of the conflict, because unsatisfactory uh, that arising inside make us to to cry and in Buddhism actually anger is not uh, bec uh, you furious you uh, or your your face become red and actually anger in Buddhism is mean like when you feel unsatisfied you're like oh it's not go along what what you want you know then when you feel unsatisfied that we call tosa tosa and tosa is broader than anger and actually tosa could it could involve be it involve with all the topics. Yes, yes. So that is uh, just a definition of uh, uh, anger in Buddhism. Okay. Okay, so now uh, uh, what I brought with me today, I think uh, it is said that there are three, uh, 13 steps, uh, 13 steps, uh, how to... The 13 steps. Uh, how, how anger uh, become getting bigger. Oh, so for the 13 steps, um, it, it doesn't mean that you have to use this at the same time, but 
just just the right one <laughs> in the certain per- mm-hmm. person. Okay. Uh, actually, the step is not to. Is, this is not how to deal with the the anger yet. Then actually, but uh, here it shows the showing how anger arising, how anger get bigger, bigger, and bigger. And still, it take over our life. It, it means to see the cause of the anger. Yes, of course. So how the anger start oh. from the very little feeling, you know. So anger is not something that oh you get angry immediately, but because you may be collecting a certain feeling little by little, and it's gradually getting bigger, 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 oh. because of the consciousness, because of a uh, lack of mindfulness or whatever. So here, I, I, what, I think what is mentioned? I think it's like um, when it was run, uh, raining and the rain of the water is dropping down um, little by little. Yeah, and yeah. Finally, yeah. it falls. Yeah. And for the dropping, it means um, from different cases. Yes. When it comes yes. together, it can be the bigger problem. Mm-hmm. So it is said that if if, if we uh, how anger start uh, uh, become uh, become bigger, so first uh, it happened in in the mind first. In the mind. In the mind. It means inside. Inside. It happened inside first. So oh, before how it, it it goes out. Yes. Yeah, so it's n- so that is the, the result of the anger. Oh. So it's showing of the. Uh, the 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 power of the anger. Oh. So now uh, and actually, like for example, if we hear someone say something that we really dislike or we 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 hate hate that kind of word or whatever, and when we hear is we we and the sound and ear contact, uh-huh. touching our ear, and, and we hear that the word is not no, it's not nice word, you know, critical. So then the anger start arising. Oh, I didn't like. Mm. No, I, I hate this word. You know, you see that inside hatred arising, frustrating, dislike. You know, then then one is occurring in the mind. So, the following is will show up on that person face. Oh. And so when 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 you see someone, you know. Uh, when you say something, maybe uh, maybe he or she didn't like uh, what you're saying. You can observe their feeling through their face. Okay. Their face will turn maybe uh, red or mm. turn to. Uh-huh. I I can feel it, and yeah, sometimes it can be red, um, different kind of um, uh, something that happens in his face or even his eyes. Because of um, yeah, something happened. The, the yeah. eyes become red. Yeah, something happened inside he, he, this person. Yeah, you see from the mind now it show up on the body. Yeah, e- yeah even though he he doesn't speak it out. Yes, of but course. But we can still feel it. Yeah, so that's why this next step, like the third step, is lift the mouth. Lift Start the mouth uh, or your mouth or like that person mouth. Begin, uh, begin checking, like he he want to say some explain something out. So maybe saying a bad word or whatever in return. I I think he is showing his teeth. Um, mm. could be. Could yeah, be. like a. I I uh, yeah. Yeah. Then 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 uh, that person will start blaming or say bad word. Vocality. Or say bad word, or blame, start blaming. So oh, now, stay, stay now, now it's come out f- through his words. Oh. You know, this is occur in ciphers now, through their uh, through their body, and now out from the words. And now it's become words. So it means that before the word come out, it's much suffer inside yeah, absolutely. before it's passing to yeah. others. Then what what happened next? You know, so. Uh, so that person will look for stick, stick. or a piece of wood or whatever oh. weapon that, that will harm other people. You know, a- so as like we have seen from the crib. Right? Yeah. So so that, that that is the step. You know, you see the process that's oh. starting getting bigger. So then, uh, what happened is he would take that wood or weapon, take that 
You see, this, he will take that with a weapon, then raise it up, uh, raise, raise the weapon up, and then uh, he will uh, catch that person. Oh. And catch that person, then he will cause other people to, to harm or maybe hurt him or he beat him or maybe, uh, uh, how to say, uh, slight or whatever. Or kill or uh, whatever. To, yeah, to cause to cause uh, that person uh, to to break to break uh, to break other bone broken or to to cut or slash other body into pieces mm. or uh, to hurt other people simply to hurt other people or even even to take other people life oh. to kill someone or shot someone you it see uh, how and, dangerous and it is so they are it starts from a very small thing, you see. Yes, just because we are not aware of what we're listening. And we just like criticize it. That is word. Oh. Claiming that that is word, bad word. You see the process. And actually to step... I, I, I think we should um, look over even the small things. Mm -hmm. uh, like um, we might think that, oh, it's okay. I, I just want to do it. It's okay. I yeah, so because um, the small thing can become the bigger things. Yeah, so mindfulness is very important when 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 uh, when we are going to deal with any uh, uh, feeling that arises, especially anger. When it's become very powerful, it's very difficult to control it. Yeah. So if we are aware when it starts, especially when we are aware of our ear. And actually, when it, when it start to begin arising in our mind, we can stop it there immediately because we never train how to aware of our sensation. So we we allow this feeling arising in our, our mind easily, and that is a cause of the anger. How it arises and how it's come out through our action, even and, and still is harm other people. Okay. Um. So. This is about how the anger arised, and I think meditation is one of the core things that we we will be able to deal with it. And all right, um, now is the time for taking a break, and for the last section, we will talk about how to deal with the anger.
Alright, welcome back to um, the Monk Chat Radio program. And in the first section, we talk about how to deal with the anger. And there are some, some more techniques in order to deal with the anger. How are they? And the reason I'm curious, after our other techniques, in order to deal with the anger. Okay, and that that's very interesting you know, to deal with the anger and actually, and yeah, so uh, to deal with the ang- anger is actually uh, some people find it very easy, but some people it's very difficult to 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 stop, not to feel angry at someone who do something bad or say something bad to us. And uh, what about you? What do you usually deal with your anger? What what what? When you get angry or when somebody says something bad or do something that you don't really like? Oh. <laughs> um, for me, I, I just let it go. <laughs> just let it go. Oh, when the anger comes, just let that, it go. Is that easy? Yes. Oh. It can be easy and it can be difficult. Uh-huh. It, um, for me, I think uh, it depends on the situation. And I personally, dealing with the anger... Is by observing, observing the the suffer person, mm-hmm. in order to understand him, what has happened to him, and try to reason carefully and try to help him in whatever techniques that I can help. Nice. And what do you think about you? Uh, to me, I, I, uh. Uh, mindfulness always helps, and and I think to to we 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 have to uh, improve our awareness. So most of the time, I I, I realize that whenever I I lack of mindfulness or I'm heedless, so it's very difficult to 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 control. I said to control our emotional to get the anger calms down. So the way. The way that I usually uh, uh, practice to deal with the anger, actually, I just uh, observe the feeling that arising in on the body. You mean your feeling or on others' feelings? Uh, my my feeling actually. So um, whatever happened in in my mind, it will affect to my body. Uh, like uh, when I feel ang- when I feel Angry, my uh, my my ear, you know, my ear becomes Get red, uh, red, and it's uh, it's hotter, you know, oh. it's hotter, and and my breath become uh, uh, shorter and shorter, you know, and very frequent, it's very quick, and instead of thinking about the story or uh, that person word or what he just did, I come back to my body come back to myself and observing the feeling or or the, the thing or the phenomena or situation that is happening on my body, especially uh, with my breath. So I observe my breath and observing that is um, uh, I'm breathing in and bringing out short or long or whatever. And sometimes I observe my ear. Uh-huh. So I observe that the heat of, of my ear and still the heat on my ear gradually fade away and my emotion just calm down oh. uh, so that that's what I often uh, uh, do in my uh, when I face him with anger or I, I fed with somebody that's I and uh, he made me angry I totally agree with you because um, in order to deal with the anger we're supposed to deal with our self or our mindfulness if we don't you love it or we don't practice um, mindfulness meditation, we cannot observe it, and we can. It's hard to to control our emotions when the emotions and when the emotion arise, up and down, we cannot catch it. Yeah, I, the first thing we have to practice meditation, and you have another easy way. Uh, the the other ways I'm 
Uh, and actually, there's many different ways to deal with the anger, our own anger. So, but uh, today I, I just want to uh, mention about the how how to deal with the anger according to the teaching of the Buddha. I think every single one of us, or like for those who are not the enlightened one yet, or even uh, at the first level of enlight- enlightened one, also. Uh, uh, still have anger sometimes, uh, who are not, uh, who are not arahanta or perfectly enlightened. So, uh, what, what the Buddha mentioned about the how to deal with the anger, and what he said is that, uh, he, he gave many, many ways, but okay. today I, I, I pick up only, uh, four different points I think is very useful and I think we can apply in our mm. everyday life. Yes. And the first one, he, he suggests, the Buddha suggests that, uh, think about the result of the anger. The uh, result of the anger. Uh, the result of the, the anger. Core of the anger. Yes, so why you're feeling angry. Oh. And stop. Maybe it's not to stop and thinking about the result. Mm. And the result of what's going to happen. Like if somebody are uh, angry at you and you react to him, think in this way. And if you react to him, it means that uh, you are not different from him. Yes. So that's why you are like the same like that person. In even like how yeah. how is very uh, how to say uh, it's yeah. foolish, you know, to to get angry at someone who are angry. Uh, so that's why think this way. So the anger will gradually. Uh, reducing. Mm. And this is another way that uh, the Buddha suggests. What about the next one? And the second one, he suggests that uh, uh, think about good thing in someone or that one, that person who are angry. Oh, and, and I'm sure that we all have goodness in the individual. Yes, we both have Good sides and bad sides, and rather think about only in, on, uh, in his, uh, in in the negative side of him, but we instead think of the good, good thing in him or whatever. Maybe he, he, he angry person, but he may have the other side that maybe, uh, he can he he is skillful, or maybe he, uh, he good at, uh, he good at. He loves giving, or maybe he good at uh, uh, reading, or he good at teaching, or whatever. Try to think that some someone goodness, so it will help us to reduce our anger, mm. and that is another technique. Mm. Uh, and the next one, he he suggests that think about uh, uh, think about. That I uh, think that anger only brings suffering. Anger never brings happiness. Or oh, you 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 angry and you you feel happy. No, I, I no. don't feel happy. Yo, no one feel happy with anger and no. get angry. And nobody wants to feel sad, sorrow, unhappy life. And yeah, yeah, this is very true. And actually, anger never. Uh, never be overcome by anger. So it means that we have to change our, the way of thinking, right? Yes, totally the way of thinking. So awareness and mindfulness are totally the key. Mm. Totally the key to deal with the anger. And this is just the, the Buddha just suggests to for the detail for someone who don't have, how, how, don't know, don't really know how to deal with the anger. Oh, so next time, don't feel anger. All right? Don't feel anger. Yeah, impossible. Remind oneself. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now uh, let's move to the, the, the next one. Uh, the Buddha said that uh, think about, uh, uh, think, think, think that every living being have their own karma. The karma from the past life or at this present life? Um, uh, when we talk about karma, karma means action. What goes around comes around. So if he get angry, he will get that result of being oh. angry. So if we are not angry, we will get the result of not being angry. What the, the result of not being angry is the, like peace, of course. 
So if you're angry, the result is suffering. I think Hot. in this case, it, it's similar with the, um, the people who win World Fifth. If we associate it with good people, and we always have the good things come to your life, uh, come to the life. Yeah, of course. So uh, that's why um, when 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 angry anger arising, we just uh, think in 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 the compassionate uh, in in the compassion way. And uh, and I think uh, to deal with anger, I think which is pretty work is to see that all living being are friend. Uh, all living being have the same thing, to share the same feeling. It's suffering. So if we think that way, we will be able to see other people feeling that anger is something suffering exists in them. And to deal with the anger, we need to cultivate our uh, loving kindness and always cultivate loving kindness to happen in in our mind. And I think the key uh, to deal with anger, I think, is nothing but loving kindness. Okay, right now it comes to the end of our radio program. And first of all, I'm very thankful for our guest speaker today. No, you're welcome. It's my pleasure. Thank you very much. And so... For the last thing, I I found some quote that it is very useful. I think it would be useful for uh, the end of the radio. So I will read for the richness. Silence is the best answer to everyone who doesn't value your words. And finally, I hope. Um, written, listeners will get something new or if you think that this thing is would suitable or would helpful for you, please take it and apply it into your life. Okay, thank you very much. <laughs> Sit down, 